and I'm hearing a lot of talk about this new innovative test. All the five-star riders are using it to ensure maximum performance. So it caused a lot of buzz at the LA Masters with John Whitaker and Argento, and they won the opening class. So that's when everyone started to take notice. So I want to go talk to Dr. Heinrich Anhold, the founder, and I want to find out exactly what this is all about. I'm here with the founder of Stable Lab, Dr. Heinrich Anhold, and he's going to tell us about a new test kit that all the five-star riders are talking about. Stable Lab is something that allows riders and their team to ensure their horses are going to perform at the best of their ability when they travel to these big shows. But what does it look like? How are they going to bring it to the shows exactly? So, so Stable Lab is new in three ways. It's, it's a handheld uh, blood test, so I mean it, you can run it at the horse's side in 10 minutes. So it's like a big iPhone that takes little cartridges and uh, you need a new cartridge for each test. Um, it's also new in the way that it uses this biomarker called serum amyloid A. And the third way that it's new is that it's, it's actually designed to be much more like a thermometer than a lab report. So it's like a better thermometer, it's more sensitive and you can use it in the same way to uh, understand if your horse is sick or not. So if your horse is coughing, is that an allergy or is it an infection? If your horse ships in and he looks dull, does, does the horse actually have um, a problem or is it just uh, that he's not happy that? Now, well, did you actually found this new biomarker, SAA? So, yeah, so my background is that I have a PhD in biochemistry. I also have a background in show jumping. And um, my discovery was that, uh, well, it was quite technical around the biomarker, serum amyloid A, but I was able to show that it can distinguish an infection from a non-infection. And that's really significant because non-infections don't require antibiotic treatment and most infections, not all, but most infections do. That's what I really discovered about this biomarker, that's what we patented. And from there I turned it into a product and we launched it on the market two years ago. I understand that at the LA Masters, Stable Lab caused quite a bit of buzz with John Whitaker and Argento. Can you tell me a little bit about that? Yeah, so we, it was the first time we'd, we had screened horses post-shipping, I guess five-star horses post-shipping and we found an, an infection early on in Argento just after he shipped in. We treated it straight away and he actually went on to win the opening class of the show. So it was, um, it did, it did, it created a lot of buzz and as a result of that a lot of bigger yards across Europe have really started using this uh, whenever they're shipping their horses and that's why we're here. We're here to uh, test the horses here in Miami we're following them on to Mexico and then Shanghai. So similarly, Bertram Allen's Quite Easy also had an elevated test result. Can you tell me a little bit about that? Yeah, so when Quite Easy shipped in, he, he, was, uh, in, he was in pretty good form but um, we, ran his, we ran his blood and we found that he had an immune challenge. Um, so it's, these horses don't really get sick, it's, it, it doesn't ha happen that often. But what we're trying to pick up actually is just an immune challenge, something minor that might affect the horse's performance and that's really what the test is working well for in this, in this context. And um, we saw that um, his, his stable lab results were high and um, they stayed high for over a day so we decided to treat with antibiotics. Um, or the veterinarians here on site decided to treat with antibiotics and um, he recovered. I mean, we saw recovery within two days and well, yesterday he finished third in his first uh, competition, which was uh, proof, I guess, that uh, Quite Easy was in good form and, um, you know, that we managed that case really well. So this is the Stable Lab handheld reader. Um, it's really simple and um, easy to use. And small. And small, yeah. We worked really hard to condense uh, a lab analyzer into something small enough to use a uh, horse sight. Brilliant. And then to run a test you just need one of these. Okay, so why don't we give it a try? Yeah, let's go for it. So um, in the pack you've got three things. You've got the test cartridge, um, the blood captor, which is a disposable pipette and our dilution bottle. And it sucks in just exactly the amount of blood you need. That's perfect. So it's uh, it's it's very simple and easy to see when you get the right volume of blood. You insert it in the bottle, that's correct. Give it a mix and just add four drops to the well. Perfect, you're like a pro. <laughs> <laughs> so and that's it, just wait 10 minutes. This is where basically riders or managers, they're gonna be doing this in consultation with their vet, yes? Yes, absolutely. We, we, we only sell this product to veterinarians. And in fact, it's the veterinarian will come out and run this for you. Um, and, and there isn't really a risk itself in running the test. So sometimes veterinarians will leave the test 
with, uh, with the barn manager to, to run. Um, I guess the risk comes in, in the treatment and it's very important that you consult with the veterinarian before using antibiotics because this, this test will identify both viral and bacterial infections and of course right. viral infections don't require antibiotic treatment so it's, right. it's really important and it's something we advocate as a company which is the responsible use of antibiotics. Okay, so where can I find out more about StableLab? Well, of course, you've got our, our website, StableLab.com, yeah. and um, our YouTube channel. We have a really cool YouTube channel with, with lots of stories from the riders, from horses. We have a very nice Argento story up on our YouTube channel. It's really Fantastic. worth a watch. And um, yeah, we, we, we work very hard to try and bring out stories to help people understand how to benefit from the test.